Dozens of newly planted trees have now been destroyed in St. Paul, causing tens of thousands of dollars in damage. Police are trying to figure out who destroyed all of these trees and why somebody would do this. Bill Keller is live in St. Paul this morning with what we know. Good morning, Bill. Good morning, and of course, most homeowners know exactly how expensive landscaping can be. And for in fact, anyone who's ever planted a, a tree, even like this little one here, knows how much work goes into it, which of course begs the question, why would somebody go through all the effort to tear so many trees right out of the ground? But that is exactly what happened. Between Wednesday night and Thursday morning, someone uprooted as many as 60 newly planted trees, pulled right from the ground, some even thrown into the Mississippi River. These are photos posted by a group called Tree Trust. It shows all that's left after a two-day urban canopy revitalization project. This was work done along Shepherd Road downtown in uh, St. Paul. The nonprofit teamed up with the city, along with some local high school students, to plant these trees. They did this last month during the MEA school break. Officials estimate the total damages, about $40,000. On its Facebook page, the Tree Trust's executive director said, quote, this senseless act of vandalism has caused substantial damage, and we are committed to supporting any replanting efforts. In fact, Tree Trust staff, along with some workforce trainees, they've already replanted as many trees that could be saved, but there are still dozens of empty holes along the parkway behind me uh, along Shepherd, the Parks and Rec Department. They are working with police to try and identify who's responsible. No arrests have been made. The big question, of course, Hannah and Tom, why would somebody do this? Back to you. Exactly right. right. And Bill, we hope we know there are cameras everywhere these days. We hope maybe some ring cameras or yeah. some other cameras set up find the images of who did this. Thank you. Thanks, Bill.